Hi, this is Realtor Mike Thomas from Palm Beach County, Florida. Just um, making a video about home prices. You guys are probably all wondering why are home prices so high here and what's going on with home prices and inflation. So let's talk about that right now. So in the last couple of years, home prices really have gone up. Well, inflation's gone up, gas prices have gone up, food's gone up, electricity's gone up, everything has gone up. Uh, home prices, uh, home prices, all the same. So let's talk about inflation and what causes inflation. It is consumer buying. So as long as people are out there buying products and don't care about how much things cost, then it reaches its limit. Um, question, would you buy an iPhone right now for $5,000. The answer is all like, mm, no, I'm going to keep my, my iPhone that I have now. And so that's what inflation is, is what people are willing to pay for it. Now, I've gotten to the point where I look at stuff and go, do I really need that? Is it a need or is it a want? Uh, of course, housing, food, transportation, things like that are essentials and you do need those things. However, um, I've owned my car a lot longer than I normally do, just simply because I didn't want to go out and buy another car. Um, I decided to stay in my own house instead of selling my house and moving again and buying something newer, better, whatever. I decided, you know what, I'm just going to stay here. So those are my decisions. That's how I handle inflation. Uh, I simply put it down on paper and think about what I'm willing to pay for stuff. And that is inflation as a, in a nutshell. Now, the federal government, they decided, um, the Federal Reserve decided to raise the interest rate. That's how we're going to handle inflation. So um, who does that really hurt? Is people that need mortgages, uh, the poor people. Rich people don't need mortgages, so they don't care. The poor people in the middle class, they need a mortgage to buy a house. So that affects the majority of people out there. Um, I don't think that's, you know, the way to do it, but I'm not an economist. So, you know, they may have their own reasons for doing that. I don't know. What I do know is inflation comes from people buying products at a higher price. And if everyone stopped buying hot products at a higher price, of course, you're going to need gasoline in your car and you're going to need a car, but it doesn't have to be like a brand new car. Uh, you need housing, you need a roof over your head, you need clothes, you need food, those kind of things I understand. But you probably don't need the latest and greatest telephone to take pictures with of your friends out there. Um, you may not need a brand new car. Your car may be good to drive for another two years, three years, whatever it is. I don't know your situation, but home prices are the same. I've heard a, a CEO of a major corporation say, we raised our prices because people were willing to pay more. And I'm going, wow, that is not something that I would have said. I would have said, hey, we had to raise our prices because everything else has gone up proportionally. Uh, you know, uh, electricity, uh, fuel prices, uh, um, you know, uh, uh, employment, uh, wages has gone up. So we had to raise our prices. That's what I would have said. I wouldn't have said anything as, you know, as dumb as, oh, people are willing to pay more, so we raised our prices. I mean, who says that? I don't know. That's my take on inflation and on real estate prices. I know that people are out there still concerned, but there is a better way. I have a video uh, on my YouTube channel. You should subscribe to my channel uh, because it has a lot of good information out there on how to still live here in Palm Beach County, Florida without having to pay a fortune. So probably going to be the title of my on my next video, but I think it was a couple of videos ago, I made a video about um, about living here in Florida and about still
being able to have the home of your dream without paying the huge prices that uh, that are going on right now. Are prices going to come down? I don't know. I think they are leveling out. Um, I don't know if they're going to come down. And only America knows whether it's going to come down based on what they're willing to pay and who outbids you. And sometimes that's a, that's a tough game. You know, there's a lot of people out there that have money and cash and that are buying houses and um, the people that need financing and want to get into a place may not stand a chance. Uh, anyway, inflation is supply and demand. And as long as that there is a low supply and high demand, prices are going to be high no matter what it is, whether it's a home, whether it's a phone, whether it's a car, or whatever it may be. So this is Realtor Mike Thomas giving you my opinion on home prices and why they're so high. Uh, please leave me a comment below. Give us a like if you like us. And uh, please subscribe to the channel and click the notification bell.